A sunburst is another easy way to add emphasis. In PowerPoint, you can come up to the Insert tab, and on the Shapes menu, if you scroll all the way down here to the Stars and Banners section, this whole first row right here is a bunch of different explosion and star shapes. So these are kind of fun to experiment with, and you can pick what looks nice with your content. You go ahead and draw that onto your slide, and then we'll go ahead and format it. So on the Format tab, we'll choose a fill. We'll make this yellow, and I usually like to remove the outline, but you can experiment with what it looks like to keep the outline in, maybe. Make it com complement the colors of your slide design. And of course, there's a bunch of shapes, effects that you can work with as well. I'll put a little shadow on this one. So once you've drawn your shape, then you can animate it. And for animations, seems like the best ones for this shape are fade or zoom. If you really want to get crazy, you could experiment with grow and turn, but that might be um, a little bit too dramatic depending on your content. We'll go with zoom this time. And then you can move it into place for whatever word you want to emphasize and then kind of size it up. Doesn't have to cover up the whole word, um, but just to, you know, kind of draw attention behind the word is what our goal is. And right now, of course, it's not behind the word, it's in front of the word. So we need to send it to the back, which we do on the format tab. So in the format tab, we'll choose send backward and then send to back. And that should look pretty good. Maybe a little bit small, we'll kind of make that a little bit larger. There we go, that looks pretty good. And then if you want to add an exit animation, that's totally fine too. So on the animations tab, you can choose add animation. And then down here, there's a bunch of exit animations. You could make it, you know, zoom back out, or you could make it fade, whatever seems to work well for you. So let's preview this and we'll see how it looks to call attention to the word with a sunburst. So there it is, and then it's going to go back out. So it might be a little cheesy for some slide designs, but it actually you know, seems to work well in a lot of different contexts, so it's something that you might want to experiment with.